if you would be a real seeker after truth, it is necessary that at least once, in your life you doubt, as far as possible, all things. The reading of all good books is like conversation with the finest men of past centuries. Conquer yourself rather than the world. Common sense is the most widely shared commodity in the world, for every man is convinced that he is well supplied with it. Doubt is the origin of wisdom. Except our own thoughts, there is nothing absolutely in our power. I think, therefore I am. To know what people really think, pay attention to what they do, rather than what they say. It is not enough to have a good mind, the main thing is to use it well. The greatest minds are capable of the greatest vices as well as of the greatest virtues. I desire to live in peace and to continue the life I have begun under the motto to live where you must live unseen. You just keep pushing. You just keep pushing. I made every mistake that could be made. But I just kept pushing. It is only prudent never to place complete confidence in that by which we have even once been deceived. To live without philosophizing is in truth the same as keeping the eyes closed without attempting to open them. But in my opinion, all things in nature occur mathematically. There is nothing more ancient than the truth. In order to seek truth, it is necessary once in the course of our life to doubt, as far as possible, of all things. In order to improve the mind, we ought less to learn than to contemplate. Divide each difficulty into as many parts as is feasible and necessary to resolve it. Each problem that I solved became a rule which served afterwards to solve other problems. At last I will devote myself sincerely and without reservation to the general demolition of my opinions. Let whoever can do so deceive me. He will never bring it about that I am nothing, so long as I continue to think I am something. It is a mark of prudence never to place our complete trust in those who have deceived us even once. Bad books engender bad habits, but bad habits engender good books. I am accustomed to sleep and in my dreams to imagine the same things that lunatics imagine when awake. It is best not to go on for great quest for truth, it will only make you miserable. Nothing is more fairly distributed than common sense, no one thinks he needs more of it than he already has. The destruction of the foundations necessarily brings down the whole edifice. The dreams we imagine when we are asleep should not in any way make us doubt the truth of the thoughts we have when we are awake. Whenever anyone has offended me, I try to raise my soul so high that the offense cannot reach it. For the very fact that my knowledge is increasing little by little is the most certain argument for its imperfection. One should never judge anything unless it is known. The first precept was never to accept a thing as true until I knew it as such without a single doubt. My third maxim was to try always to master myself rather than fortune and change my desires rather than changing how things stand in the world. Am I so tied to a body and senses that I am incapable of existing without them? For to be possessed of a vigorous mind is not enough, the prime requisite is rightly to apply it. When it is not in our power to determine what is true, we ought to follow what is most probable. Truths are more likely to have been discovered by one man than by nation. It is prudent never to trust those who have deceived us, even if only once. Thanks for watching subscribe and share this video.